Hey guys, um, I just got my MacBook Pro. It's pretty early in the morning, so that's why I kind of look like this. Anyway, um, never gonna believe this. I just did a whole unboxing video for you guys, and then I realized the iSight isn't recording. So now it's completely unboxed, and... So yeah, I'm just gonna like show it to you guys, and go from there. It's pretty much the same thing. You didn't really miss much. I'll show you the box, but here we go, guys. Alright, we've got power adapter, which is very nicely wrapped. And then we had this thing, which I opened. It was inside to protect the screen. Alright, I'm going to show you the box real quick. The box is really small. Like, it's... Like, look at it compared to the actual computer. It's really not that much bigger. Um, let's just do that quick. Basically, what happened was you open it. You've got this nice little, like, padding here. You know, the foam inside here? You can, like, sleep on this shit. The computer is lying here. You lift this little tab up. I'm sure you guys have all seen the videos on YouTube already anyway. I don't want this to be the same as all the other ones because that'll be boring. Um, everything Mac, everything else, and I have an iWork DVD because I got iWork pre-installed. I don't know if that actually comes with it and then I'm just going to get a license or something, but I ordered iWork pre-installed on my MacBook Pro. Alright, so now I'm going to shut this down. I actually really like the box. It's very small. It's very, like, light. If it didn't have MacBook Pro written on the front, I would probably carry it as a case. Like, it's really small and very thin, like, see? Alright. Now for the good stuff. Here we go, ready? Am I the only person who saved the plastic the MacBook Pro came in? It's kind of nice. Alright. This is really, really thin. Like, a lot thinner than I was expecting it to. That's what I said in the other video, but wasn't recording. Anyway. Um, yeah, it's very thin. Like, I don't think you can really appreciate how thin it is until you actually, like, hold one yourself. I mean, even when I, I held one in the Apple store though, and it really didn't like affect me until I have it here. It hasn't really sunk in that I own a MacBook Pro. I don't know, I guess it's different when it's yours. But, like look at this, I can pick it up with one hand, and I can do that with my other, with my MacBook, the Core Duo, the white one. But, like, I don't know, it's just not as sturdy, like this is very sturdy. And like you can feel that it's strong, you know? Like I feel like if, even if, like, not that I ever would, but you know, if you drop this, like, I think it would be okay. Like it's lying. So alright, so let's open it up. Oof, it's nice. Yeah, look how nice the screen is. It's reflective, obviously, it's the glossy screen. It's 13 inches. And keyboard's really nice too. It feels just like my MacBooks, but I don't know, for some reason it feels like a little, like, less susceptible to the grease on your fingers, you know? Um, the trackpad's beautiful, and it's really nice, like, I'm clicking it right now, and it doesn't feel like it's much different than a mouse, because, like, up here, see, I used to think that the whole thing was a trackpad, it's actually, like, well, it is a trackpad, but you know what I mean, like a button? Up here, you can't click, only down here. Like, okay, wait, you can't really see that. Up here, you really can't click. Yeah, there we go, there it is. This doesn't click. Here is where it clicks. So, yeah, so it's like pretty much like having a mouse, you know, like having my current MacBook trackpad, you know, it'll be the same thing. Um, I'm really anxious to turn this on, so I think I'll leave it at that because pretty much all there is to see here. I'll definitely make more videos related to the MacBook Pro, but I'm not sure if they'll be separate videos or what, but either way, you'll be seeing more, so.
Can I use these or anything? So don't worry, I'm going to be posting a lot more videos about the MacBook Pro. Um, I even think I'm going to post a video of me packing up my MacBook Core Duo. The, sorry. The nose ring thing again. I think I'm going to do a video of me packing up my Core Duo MacBook and getting it ready for my friend Luke. Because I think that would be, like, weird. Like, not weird, but, you know, different. Because nobody really does that. Nobody shows them actually getting rid of a computer. We show you getting a computer. So I think it would be cool. And trust me, I'm going to take very good care of it when I get rid of it. I'm kind of sad. 